In this video, how to upgrade Windows 11 using the Windows 11 Installation Assistant. First, visit the official Windows 11 download page. From here, you can download the Windows 11 Installation Assistant. To continue, you need to use the PC Health Check app to check compatibility. Let's download and install it. As you can see, this computer meets Windows 11 requirements, and we can continue with the upgrade process. Go back to the Installation Assistant and follow the instructions to update Windows 11. It will automatically download the latest version of Windows 11. While installing the updates, all apps and data will remain safe but it's recommended to save your work frequently. Once the process is complete, your PC will restart in 30 minutes, or you can click Restart Now to restart immediately. As you can see, Windows has been upgraded to the latest version without any data loss. Additionally, using this method, you have 10 days to roll back to the previous version without losing your apps and data. As you can see, Windows has been successfully reverted to the previous version, Windows 11 23H2, without any data loss. In some cases, if your computer doesn't meet the requirements for upgrading to Windows 11, you cannot use the Windows 11 Installation Assistant for upgrading. To upgrade, you need to download the Windows 11 ISO from Microsoft and mount it into your computer. Hold the Shift key while right-clicking on the setup.exe file and copy the full path of the file. Next, search for CMD command prompt. Right-click and run it as administrator. Right-click to paste the path into the CMD window and add this to the command. This will initiate a server-focused installation or upgrade, bypassing Windows 11 system requirements. It will say installing server, but it is actually installing Windows 11. As you can see, the warning was gone, and we can upgrade Windows normally. As you can see, Windows has been upgraded to the latest version without any data loss. That's it. Thanks for watching.
Don't forget to like and subscribe and see you in the next videos.